fingers on buzzers, teams. Yeah. Why was this little drawing in the news this week? It's only got seven legs. Ah, oh, is this wow. a spider? Can only turn left? <laughs> No, this is the spider drawing that was offered as settlement of an overdue utility bill. <laughs> <laughs> Australian man David Thorne wrote to an accounts department. <laughs> Dear Jane, I do not have any money, so I'm sending you this drawing I did of a spider instead. <laughs> I value the drawing. $233.39, so I trust that this settles the matter. <laughs> Regards. David. <laughs> what did they say to that? Well, it didn't work. Uh, yeah. uh, to Mr Thorne's surprise, accounts clerk Jane Gillis felt that the company would prefer the bill to be paid using money. <laughs> Here's a drawing of you opening the door to the bailiffs. <laughs> He's got eight legs on it, really. Well, yeah, really, he cheated them on a, thing, on a leg. Well, this is the thing, you see. Um, the, matter, the, the whole matter of the legs came up. Mm. Um, uh, she returned his email and he questioned its authenticity, saying, are you sure this drawing of a spider is the one I sent you? <laughs> this spider only has seven legs. <laughs> and I do not feel I would have made such an elementary mistake when I drew it. <laughs> In a year's time, it'll all be our currency. <laughs> David Thorne has been described as a self-confessed serial prankster from Australia. What's not to like? <laughs> the original spider drawing had seven legs. It's been nicknamed Heather Mills. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not because it's got a missing leg, but because it once trapped a beetle. <laughs> Meanwhile... 